Hello guys. So in this question, we will solve this question related to Green's theorem. So here, what the question is saying that we have to use the Green's theorem to evaluate this integral where the curve sees the triangle with vertices 0, 0, 1, 0 and 1, 1. So we will have to find the work done basically around the vertices of the triangle. So first of all, we will draw this curve. Let's suppose this is x axis, this is y axis. Then we have to plot these points. So 0, 0 is the origin, we all know this. So let this point as A. 1, 0, let's suppose this point is on x axis as 1, 0. So this point will be B and this point will be 1, 1. So if we will join these lines, this will become a right angle triangle. So this is the path represented by the arrows and this whole area under this triangle is let us assume it as D and this point is C. So first we will write the Green's theorem here like Green's theorem. So what is it states that m dx plus n dy along a curve is equal to del n by del x minus del m divided by del y and we have to find the double integral along the <coughs> shaded region D. So first if we will compare this m dx plus n dy by y cube dx plus x cube dy then we can easily find out the value of m as y cube then we will differentiate m with respect to y so it will become 3 y square. If we will compare this result with the statement given in the question then n is equal to x cube plus 3 x y square. Then if we will find del n divided by del x is equal to this will be 3 x square and this will be 3 y square. Now from the both if we will subtract del n divided by del x minus del m divided by del y then this 3 y square will be cancelled. So we can write it here 3 x square plus 3 y square minus 3 y square. So this whole term will be cancelled. So it will be equal to 3 x square. Now to solve the above <coughs> integral we will use 3 x square this will be dy this will be dx along the curve d. So now we have to uh, use the property of double integral that uh, we can see that x coordinate varies from 0 to 1 and y coordinate varies from this line to this line th that is joining a and c. So now we can write the equation of line ac as y is equal to x. So y, y varies from 0 to x and x varies from 0 to 1. So these are the limits of the double integral. We will use it here to solve this question like this will be from 0 to x, this will be from 0 to y and this 3x square dy dx. Now first we have to integrate this integral with respect to y and assuming x as constant then dy integration will be y and if we will put the limit so it will become 3x square multiplied by x because it will uh, like uh, dy integration is y and if we will put li limit from 0 to x it will be x. So it will be directly multiplied to 3x square and we have to integrate now with respect to x. So it will basically as uh, we can treat it as 3x cube 
so if we will find the integral of 3x cube it will be 3x to the power 4 by 4 and integration limit will be 0 to 1 so 3 by 4 is constant it will be uh, thrown out of the box and this will be 1 to the power 4 is 1 minus 0 so basically the value of Green's theorem value of this integral by Green's theorem is 3 by 4 and here the answer is also given so our answer is verified so we can write this as answer we can also solve it by using parametric coordinate directly by using this LHS but here we have to use the Green's theorem because it is asked in the question and if you would like to ask any more type these type of questions from calculus like algebra like trigonometry or any other science related subject then please do mention your doubts in comment box or visit our website thank you very much